to double check. Oh, I have to play as Juno, apparently. Okay. Yay. What up, guys? Trevor and Carl of the Ice Mask Gang, and I've got a migraine, and I'm at Carl, so Carl's gonna go ahead and do some Omega Strikers for you guys. Yeah. The free version of freaking Mario Strikers. With just as many characters. So. So. Yeah. Yeah. It's pretty much how. Okay, so I'm. Good lord. Yeah, this is gonna be a while. What's good? What do you gotta do? Yep. Ready to see it not through the, uh. Share play? Share yeah. play? go with these. Oh, they, they buffed it. It used to be 30%. Now it's 40 unless... No. No, they straight buffed the Vicious Vampires. Ooh. <laughs> no wonder I've been absolutely wrecking everybody in terms of tankiness. Okay, yeah, and this is another issue, is people getting disconnected. It is? Yeah. Okay. That's that's one of the only issues in terms of that, but... Yeah, otherwise, like, these matches go hella fast. Like, I've actually got a nine-second goal. Nine-second goal? Yeah. It was literally shot straight down the middle into the, the thing. They tried to shoot out, had one of them pass towards me, shot it straight in. Huh, okay, so we're searching Super fast. for other players. Yeah, other players versus AI, which is why if you can get a team of three to play this game, there's no wait time at all. Huh, okay. And they just bang, 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 bang. The question is getting Austin or somebody on this. Or... Yeah, or just anyone. Yeah. I actually have a friend who might be interested in playing it. Okay. Yeah. But, uh... Yeah, so... Yeah, the main issue is the searching because if you're, if you if you do flex, you're a lot easy, a more, lot more likely to get a quick game. If you get uh, if you do the front, like the front line, yeah, you will be waiting for a goalie for forever. Exactly, which is why I usually run flex because I can easily use your car for any of them. Stop. There we go. Yeah, I think the maximum I've had is like three and a half minutes. Hmm, okay. Wait time. Which is actually not that bad. I mean, that's the longest I've had. The average is usually about 20 seconds hmm. at most. Oh, great. Jakar is goalie. That's going to be fun. Mostly because I have the, uh, the invis... The Xeno Cloak, where I gained 50% speed for a second. You will pick last. Speaking of which, I need to play as Juno. After, actually, you know what? We're going to go with Juno. Because I need to do that for the, the thing. It's like, I'm being stupid. I always go with Powerhouse, pow, uh, Powerhouse Pauldrons, because it gives you that damage reduction and increase in power to get it out of the way. See, is there anything? No. Juno sucks. There's a reason why I picked Jakar. It's because literally long range to keep him out of the way. So here's the. Uh... And then, yeah, literally. Pass it up and almost right in goal. Yep. 
already done. 20 seconds. A lot more fast paced than Strikers, I can tell you that much. Yes. I thought Strikers was fast paced. <laughs> and though they do seem to move, looks like the field's smaller though. And unfortunately, this is the only field as of right now, but hopefully, eventually, they'll be. Go up. Cross. There you go. And yes, it is possible for you to get a double assisted goal. I actually so had three kinda, in one match. So it's kind of like hockey where there's two assists per... Yes? Question mark? Because in hockey, like, the, the two passes leading to a goal count to, towards an assist. Yeah, but in this one, in this case, there's a cool down as to how quickly... Like, you have maybe three seconds to count for an assist. Huh, okay. So, like, a goalie shooting the one, and then the, the one that I got shot to by the goalie immediately sending it, like, that, see, I didn't, even though I did touch it, yep. that didn't count as an assist, because not only did they hit it twice, but also even if they hit it once, it was too long. You're up 4 nothing. Mm-hmm. Get out of here. And does the ball have to touch that little trapezoid before... The yeah, it, it has to hit the trapezoid in the front. And then... Uh, Doo boo. You sneaky little bastard. I think you got this in the bag, though. Oh, yeah. We definitely do. Like, if I run goalie... Mm. it up. No, no, no. And yes, you can get knocked out. Unlike in Omega Strikers, there is a literal penalty for you getting your your stamina too low. Oh, I mean unlike in Minor Strikers? Uh-huh. That's the goal. That's the goal. And that is... Yay! Victory 5-1. <laughs> Is there like a goal limit or? Yep, 5. Okay, so. It, it ends at 5. So, and so it's not like Mario Strikers. Where, where you, you can, can get go. infinite goals in. Exactly. And the cool part is, is you're, you get stuff like that. <laughs> From leveling up your account and everything, so. And I can do that. Go in here while waiting. Claim this. These allow you. These are um, affinity uh, coins. They basically allow you to. Assume I have enough time here. I can go in here. Oh, starving. I can go into a character, hit their details, and go to their uh, affinity tree. And I can spend the coins there to increase it by 5,000. Okay. So, I think I've already put 20 into car or something like that. Because it takes a while. Okay, your goalie again looks like. Yep. I really hope someone uses X. Because then we're just going to have puns, puns, puns galore. This guy over here. Yeah. I, I kid you not. All he has is anything that has EX in front of it is a pun to him.
go. Stay back. This guy is about to get... Okay. I was about to say, this guy had better get the in here. Yes, I am not doing a 2v3 again. Yes, I'm sure it's like 4.15 or 4.30. Or... I, I don't care. Okay. I, I genuinely do not care. I'm sorry, man. It's fine, dude. <laughs> you have medical issues, okay? <laughs> I, I can't stop them from happening. I know, neither can I. I've tried, tried, and tried. But yeah. So. You, sh you should have seen some of the people that I found on here. Holy crud. They good or bad? It's so freaking good, it's shocking. Like, imagine doing all five goals with a tier three character, which is three out of three difficulty. Wow. Yeah. And there's only four of them in the game. And this guy used two of them to that level. I'm like, oh, scusi? <laughs> um, please explain. Please explain, yes. Please and thank you. Yeah, it was uh, Zentaro and Ramus. I think his name's Ramus. Hmm. I'll show them. Let us let us know in the comments below if you like uh, these Omega Strikers game better, or if you like um, the Mario Striker series. The Master Seven will continue when I'm feeling better. Yeah, so I gotta get that in. So, as Carl's up three nothing, do this, man. If Dubu hadn't freaking stopped that, I would actually straight up said, "Yeah, no." Can you get a goalie goal? I have before. Oh, you deflecting some of it. I have half a mind to shoot you with my shotgun. <laughs> In fact... No, no, this is a sport. It's not... <laughs> yeah, well, screw you. I will shoot you with my shotgun. <laughs> Again, as I said in the Mario Strikers things, guns are allowed in this. <laughs> like, at least two... I know two... Uh, Jakar and Estelle both use guns. She has a sniper rifle, he has a shotgun. I think uh, the guy in the cloak over there, Yeah. Uh, I think his name's Kai, if I remember correctly, um, he, I think, has pistols. Pistol. So, like, there, there are multiple people with guns. So, if you Ooh. if you think this is Mario Striker with guns, you're at least partly right. You're like fifty percent there. <laughs> yeah, the thing that does the the, the pew, pew, pew that you just saw there. Yeah, I think that's uh, pistol. Oh, that is just a word. Match. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've had actually, I've actually had goalie MVPs. Quite a bit. You'd be surprised, actually, how many goalie MVPs I've had. You know what? It's you know what? You know what's weird about this? I'm used to like playing Mario Strikers. Yeah. And my I'm used to having my eldest cat, you know, Lynx. Yeah. Come up and climb and just start rubbing against my head. I'm trying to, like, I'm like, Lynx, I'm trying to stream here. <laughs> well, congrats, you found a safe space. Yes. But um, yeah. So, if you actually look in the detail section here, okay. and go to overview, see it has this difficulty here. Yeah, this is over. Yeah. The, the uh, difficulty shows, like, how hard they are to play. And there's only four. Uh, Aimee, Rune, Zentaro, and Rasmus. Colby Rasmus? <laughs> If you're not a if, if you're not a Cardinals fan, you won't get that joke. But 
And um, Carl the Cardinal fan, he doesn't even get it. But no. <laughs> in 2011, Cardinals player Colby Rasmus got in a fight with manager Tony Larusa. Two days later, they traded him to Toronto. <laughs> 2011, the year we won. In the World Series. He got fight in a fight with Tony La Russa. <laughs> and missed out on a World Series, series because, because, because he was... got butt hurt. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I always say Rasmus. Colby Rasmus. <laughs> but yeah, but like each of these has their own uh, play style and everything. So like uh, Estelle does a whole bunch of long range attacks. Uh, see if I can. Yeah, right here. So like. Um, here we go. Piercing shot. It allows you to just shoot a long line so you can literally snipe the freaking thing before anyone's anywhere close to it. Um, Rose Warp allows you to blink near a location. And then uh, you can follow just a crystal crystal thorns, which basically shotgun effect. So, like, each of them has their own play style. Zentaro does a whole bunch of ninja warping and shit with a uh, with a katana. So, like, each of them has their own play style. It's kind of like how Rosalina's good at shooting, Bowser's good at shooting, um, and Mario Strikers, I'm going here, but um, Luigi's good at technique and yeah, toe to speed. Each of them technically has their own strengths and weaknesses. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah. <sighs> Those meds are kicking in, see? So it's working? It's working. That's definitely Excedrin you gave me. Good. Um. And the cool part is, is look. You get uh, awakenings, which give you passives. Oh, Lord. I hope our goalie picks the power holders because that's a hundred and seventy percent size because this one gives it 35 it's and like the they... goal is going with somebody named luna yeah uh luna is the rocket person she's all about rockets rocket this rocket that set you up in the space rockets specifically but well at least pieces. you're not playing goalie for once well, yeah but sometimes you'll want to play because goalie. goalie is an easy job. You just gotta use someone who has a bash ability that won't accidentally put the the thing in the goal. Yeah, and then you get NHL goalies like Jordan Bennington, who just are just what I don't know what happened to him this year. Well, from taking the Blues to a Stanley Cup to just being an absolute monster. Not like on the hockey sense, but like the way stuff he says. Okay. It's like, um, it's so bad that the Blues coach had to have a, sit down and have a talk with him. This is a pro NHL goalie. He may be, and he's just, like he got into a fight with, another player like it's hockey but goals are not mm-hmm. supposed to be fighting mm-hmm. it's the goal he got into a fight and that's what over exactly if I may ask just because he gave up a goal like it was a big goal but he just got upset and tensions were high in that game I think it was against Dallas or something and I don't remember all the details but Composure, my dude. Composure. And he, he just... I love Bennington when he's good, but when he's bad, like this year, the Blues probably... I don't know if they should have signed up for as long as contracts they did. I mean, I get he won us a cup. First ever cup, which took, took us 50 years to win a cup. There we go. Meanwhile, this year, congratulations to the Vegas Knights, by the way, on their Stanley Cup victory, but your fan base didn't have to oh, suffer as long. Oh, oh, the Vegas Knights actually won? They won the Stanley oh, Cup Oh, I, I know who's, who's freaking ecstatic about that. 
Matt? Yeah. Yeah. Vegas, uh, born. Vegas born and raised. Yeah, that man's freaking ecstatic. There's no way he's not. Yeah. You know, the Oakland A's are moving to Vegas next year. <laughs> Why? Because, um, the stadium in Oakland's a piece of crap. And the and the um, people of Oakland uh, can't afford to build them a new stadium. It's such a poor city. That's what happens when you don't at least maintain upkeep. Let's see here. I'm slowly getting there. I'm at seventy-seven. Yeah. <laughs> out of two hundred and fifty. Yeah. The thing about the Oakland Coliseum there in Oakland. Mm-hmm. It was built in the 60s to house both the Raiders yeah. and the Oakland A's. But the Raiders in the 80s didn't like to get tired of the stadium, so they moved to L.A. for about 10 years. Mm-hmm. They got um, the Oakland Coliseum to build this um, four, this like four-deck monstrosity over the skyline of the stadium mm-hmm. that ruined everything called Mount Davis. Mm-hmm. And I can't even sell a single seat in that right now because it's so bad. So they want to get their stadium. It's falling apart. It's they can't sell tickets. You're better off just demolishing it and doing something for the betterment of the people out of it. And that and now Oakland's losing their their a fifth major sports team in five years. Oakland is. Oakland's losing their final major sports team in five okay, years. Okay, hang on. What what are what were they? I know the Raiders and the A's, but they're also the uh, Sharks. Which is the... Hockey. Moved, okay. to San, moved to San Jose. I didn't even know they existed, so... Yeah, the San Jose Sharks and um, the um, Warriors, and I forget their soccer team. Well, let this be a lesson, people. If you don't treat your sports teams right, you will lose them. Yeah. You, you you want that massive revenue that comes with sports? Treat them right. Yeah, it's like um, the fans that the, I mean the fans that do show up to Oakland games right now for baseball are like telling the um, owner of the A's to, to sell the team so they can stay, but they already have broken ground on the new stadium in, on the Vegas Strip. Oh, on the Strip. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> My dude. Wow. I'm surprised you haven't heard about it. It's been all over the national news. Do you want to know why I don't? Because you don't follow the news. I don't follow the news because they always say, oh, it's depressing this, depression that. It's like... Especially now, yeah. It's like, dude, just shut the fuck up about depressing shit. Put pictures of cats on the frickin' wall. <laughs> okay? None of that. Yeah, it's like because the Raiders moved to Vegas, and then mm-hmm. Vegas first Vegas got their expansion hockey team. Also, I think her goalie's away from the controller. You serious? Yep. Just standing there. Yep. So, uh, I'm going to ensure that just in case. You're gonna play some defense. Yeah, I'm gonna play mid range defense basically. Basically have uh, Vice there go ahead and... Uh, do everything on their own. Do, not not do everything on their own, but basically have it to where... They're the forward, you're the defense. Yeah, I'm, I'm the defensive line, they're the forward, and then we have the goalie who is clearly about to get fucking reported. Whoa! Yeah, no. Our goal is, is very much not there. So, where where's my thing? Is it here? We go. No, it's not this. Okay, future Trevor, add the um sound of I have my guys. I can't really think of what it's called, but the um the dial-up modem sound. <laughs> I think it's what's called. No, no, no. Hang on, hang on. I got this. Hey. You there? 
I think they disconnected. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Oh, ya yeah, boy. I mean, if you lose because you're goalie. Yeah, I'm, I'm literally just. <sighs> Can't they let people just do that? Well, they they also get if if they get and now they freaking move. Yeah, no, I'm still reporting them and I'm putting in there they're gone half over half the game. And now they're playing offense. You're the fucking goalie. We got it. We got live on camera too. Yeah, I know. Like, I'm sorry, but, like, this is the crap that usually happens. Yeah, no, I'm still gonna report this, dude. <laughs> okay, if you report too many people, you will get banned for mass spam reporting. Yeah, no, but I usually explain exactly why. Right. Yeah. In the, in the thing. It's like, they're gone half the game and then didn't play their role. Like, even says on the thing, if you are picked for goalie, take it seriously. I.e., if you are goalie, you are goalie. Like, that is literally one of the things that pops up on the actual thing. Let's look at it. Yeah. Unfortunately, I can't do it right now, because I have to apparently go up through this, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, where is it? Did they? Oh, there it is. Say seventy five percent. No, over three quarters. Yeah. Of the game as goalie. Goalie. Then played offense. If they were front for last goal, I love when games let you report like actually what happened, so Yep. And we are at the thirty minute mark, so. Uh yeah, let's go ahead and just wrap it up now. Okay. Well this has been our Mega Strikers. Yeah. Um let us know which which series you prefer. Maybe we'll actually get Trevor to start playing this. Maybe, yeah. But until next time, stay, stay frosty. frosty. Ice Mask Gang out.